walk into Springford's Pizzeria. The last establishment, of course, shop has been entertainment, obviously. And I say last establishment, because two years ago, we were given one last shot to fight the hype of the company, courtesy of the government. If a fella doesn't want to spot the feds, game over, man. We won't be allowed to make any more establishments, given our troubled history and will be disbanded. Anyway, first things first, do you see a camera paddle somewhere? If you did, be sure to check the cameras from time to time, because things get strange at night. Like robots roaming around at night, even though they're not supposed to and whatnot. If they do move, given the fact that we have a facial recognition system, they detect intruders that save the building after hours and try to get rid of them. Oh yeah, and speaking of robots, some of these new ones were, in fact, old robots that were from previous Fazbear Entertainment locations back in the 80s and 90s. One of the robots here were never used for any of our establishments. I'm talking about the golden mode for gloves on camera one. We did clean them when we brought them in and tested them out to see if they worked. And surprisingly, even two or three decades later, they worked! Though some of the bugs and glitches in the systems might need to be fixed before the place opens next week. But the rumors ran amok about some children haunting these robots who have haunted them in the past and came back years later to do it again. But there's nothing to worry about, right? Now, anyway, in order for you to be safe from them, there's a few defense mechanisms to use against them. Those being the laser door, signal law, and safety shock. The latter two mechanics you will use on the later night, because tonight only the laser door will be put to good use. We've installed it on your right a few weeks ago and nothing can get through them. As it will be available. Trust me, we tested the door a couple of days ago. So, if anyone were to appear on the right side, tap the button on your right and it will turn on the laser door. Tap the button again if no one is on the right side, alright? And as far as the whole defense mechanism thing goes, that's all I have for you, for tonight at least. So, make sure to test out the defense mechanisms I mentioned. The laser door included, make sure defense mechanism tests will be very useful later on. And... Oh, right! If you were to be attacked by these robots, be stuffed into a spare suit we have. So we better avoid that, right? Now, make sure to check the cams from time to time and use the laser door if someone were to appear on the right side of your office. Okay, that should be it. Good luck on your first night. Bye-bye!
Are you there? Okay, good. So, anyway, welcome to the second night here. So, tonight, Vintage Spring Fred and Golden Toy Freddy won't be the only ones to move. Because we heard that Vintage Bunny will be likely to move tonight. If he does, he might be at the left side of your office. And using the laser tool won't work on him, since the laser tool is on the right side of your office. So, how would you get rid of him? Well, there's a button named Signal Law in your camera panel, and if you were to press the button, it will not only let out signal sounds, but it will lure someone back to where they were before. So, if Vintage Bunny were to be at the left side of your office, you can go to your camera panel, press Signal Law, to lure Vintage Bunny back to his part. But, be careful, as it might have malfunction at random, we can rebuild it though. So, anyway, that should be it for tonight. Make sure to use the laser door if anyone appears on the right side of the office. And you signal law if Vintage Bunny were to get in. Now, I wish you luck again. Bye-bye.